السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم وی پرزینٹ ٹو یو لیسن نمبر نائن سیونٹی فائیو آف اوور ڈیلی نصیح اینڈ ایڈوائس اوور فوکس اینڈ ٹاپک ٹو ڈے از دا بگیننگ آف ذول ہجا وانس اٹ از کنفرمڈ ان وچ ایور کنٹری یو آر ان دیٹ دا منتھ آف ذول ہجا ہیز کومینسڈ دین ریڈ دا فالوئنگ تھری دو آرز اینڈ دیز تھری دو آرز آر سننا اینڈ وانس یو سی دا کریسن دا مون یور سیلف او اٹ از کنفرمڈ آلسو آل دو یو ہیو ناٹ سین اٹ دین آلسو یو کین ریسائٹ اٹ نمبر ون اللہ اکبر ہلال خیر و رشدین دیز ورڈس ہلال خیر و رشدین آ مینشن ان ابو داود and it means oh all my tilla make this month in this instance the month of zul hija a month of khair and goodness wa rushdin and righteousness so the hadith is mentioned in abu dawood allahu akbar hilal khair wa rushdin second dua mentioned in musnad ahmad on the authority of ubada bin samit radiyallahu an who's buried right next to masjid al aqsa Mustafa Habibuna sallallahu alayhi wasallam said when the new begin month starts the crescent decided Allahu akbar alhamdulillah la hawla wa la quwwata illa billah Allahumma inna nas'aluka khair hadha ash-shahr Allahu akbar Allah is the biggest the greatest the mightiest Alhamdulillah all praise is due to Almighty Allah la hawla wa la quwwata illa billah there is no might to take me towards goodness and good deeds there is no might and power to make me abstain and refrain from vices and sins except Allah O oh, beloved Allah we ask of thee and ask of you the best of this month and this is in Mustad Ahmad and the third dua which is authentic in Tirmidhi mentioned on the authority of Abdullah ibn Umar radiyallahu anhu who is buried here in Makkah Mukarrama Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wasallam said Allahu akbar Allahumma hillahu alayna bil amni wal iman was salamati wal islam wat tawfiq lima tuhibbu wa tarda rabbi wa rabbukallah that we beg all my Allah to make this crescent and moon loom upon us with safety and security Allah Taala protect our iman and islam Allah grant us to feed the ability capability capacity to do those actions and say that speech that is beloved to Allah and pleasing to Allah Allah is my sustainer nourisher and the sustainer nourisher of the celestial creation the moon and the crescent once it is confirmed that zil hijja has started we should know these nights the first 10 nights the first 10 days are so significant both are mentioned in the noble quran all my allah states wal fajri wa layalin ashr that this wal layalin ashr the 10 nights according to majority scholars and sahaba and scholars refers to the first 10 nights of zul hijja Similarly the 10 days of Zul Hijjah also referred to in the Noble Quran li yashhadu manafi'a lahum wa yadhkuru isma Allah fi ayyamin ma'lumat that when a person performs hajj then he will witness with his own eyes the nafa the benefit the gain that will come to him and they remember all might Allah in these days that are well known so these ayyamin ma'lumat refers to the first 10 days of Zul Hijjah so imagine the nights are also referred to and remember the night days are also alluded to and this is the verdict of majority sahaba and scholars so what should we do on each night and each day the hadith in tirmidhi sharif that regarding the fasting remember on these first 10 days 10 days means the first 9 days and i'll say first 8 days and that is siyam wa qiyam sanatin that you get the reward of fasting for one year so hence it is sunnah to fast during this first eight nine days and the night qiyam wa qiyam laylatul qadri when you make ibadat on these nights the first ten nights is like making ibadat on the night of majesty the night of destiny
Laylatul Qadri khayrun min alfi shahar. That Laylatul Qadr is better than 1,000 months. So, so important these nights are. The hadith is mentioned in Trimidhi Sharif. Why we say first eight days? Because the ninth of Zil Hijjah, the day of Arafat, there the reward is even more. Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam hadith mentioned in Sahih Muslim, Mishkat Sharif, Muslim Ahmad. Ahtasibu ala Allah, ayyu kafira sanata allati qabla wa allati ba'da. There two years sins will be forgiven when a person fasts even one day, and that is the previous year sins and the following year sins. So the minor sins would be forgiven. So we should ensure that these nights we make tawbah, we are ashamed of our vices and sins, we fulfill the rights of Allah, fulfill the rights of human beings, when we detach ourselves immediately from all the vices and sins we are involved in. I beg you, do not get involved in TV and movies and wasting time with our cell phone and missing the salat in the process, Allah forbid. Similarly, try and ensure that we reconcile with human beings as well. We have severed ties with so many people, no salam, nothing that is unacceptable. So yes, we don't have to be the best friend, but at least make salam. And thereafter, tubu ilallahi tawbatan nasuha. Turn to Almighty Allah with such a tawba that is nasuha. How the milk does not go back into the udders of the animal. So similarly, remember that we must not return to the evil and devilish lifestyle. Toba. Allah Ta'ala gave us this prescription. It is a method and a system for success. وَتُوبُوا إِلَى اللَّهِ جَمِيعًا Turn to Allah, all of you. No one is exempted. أَيُّهَا mu'minun In repentance, turn to Allah. O believers, لَعَلَّكُمْ تُفْلِحُونَ So that you are successful. So may all my telegrams to feed, to make qadr and appreciate this month of Zul Hijjah and especially the first ten day nights in the 10 days barakallahu feek assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh